Hello everyone and welcome to Long's Toys. I have another Kamen Rider x aid review for you today. This is the DX Taiku no Tatsujin Gashat and Kamen Rider Genmu DVD set. Bit of a mouthful there. But basically they did some web episodes for Kamen Rider Genmu, which you can see here. Um, they had some Legend Rider Gashats that they used, and they also featured those three uh, Gashats based on real-life Namco video games being Pac-Man, Famista, and Xavius. And I just got done reviewing the three of those, so I thought, go ahead and finish out the web series with this set. They basically put the entire web series on this DVD, and then the last uh, Gasha that was featured in the series is this here, the Taiku... <laughs> I'm going to butcher this name a couple of times, so I just apologize ahead of time. But I think it's Taiko no Tatsujin, if I'm getting that right. So, um... Yeah, so this is the set. You can take a look at the back here. It just kind of shows how the Gashat works. Very similar to the back of a normal Gashat box there. And then you get the DVD set. Now, unfortunately, the DVD is Region 4, so I have no way to watch it. Um, I don't think a Blu-ray was an option. But even if the Blu-ray was an option, it wouldn't be subbed. So, kind of a bummer. But I actually watched this uh, subbed on TV Nihon. They released a subbed version of the DVD. So, you can actually go watch the web so webisodes there. Uh, but let's go ahead, we'll get all this out of the packaging, and we'll take a closer look. So here's the set out of the packaging. I'm going to put the gash out to the side for just one moment, and we'll just take a quick look at the DVD. Uh, pretty cool packaging, though. I like the cover here. I like that a lot. You have the three uh, video game forms, as well as some Legend Riders, and then you have Genmu. Uh, taking a look at the side, I guess it's written vertically. Common Rider Exato, Common Rider Genmu. And then you can see on the back again, it has the Legend Riders, the video game forms, and the two of them. Now, I was actually wrong. I thought Japan used to be Region 4, and I don't know when that changed, or maybe I was always wrong, but it looks like it's Region 2, which I think is the same as Europe. So, Europe might be able to watch this. Not 100% on that, but it's 25 minutes long. It's just like the length of one episode. But, opening it up real quick, that is the DVD cover. No insert or anything, very bare bones, very basic. So, I'm going to put that off to the side, bring the gash hat back in, and adjust our camera so we can take a look at this. So, here is the picture. Now, this is like a drum game. You can see their drums and they have the two sticks. Taking a look at the side, Taiko no Tatsujin. QR code, batteries come included. Speaker in the bottom as per usual. Like that music. It's kind of a, like, I don't want to say mustard yellow, but like a, not really a cream either, maybe like a canary yellow, something like that. I'm not really sure how exactly to describe it. So of course you get the win and lose sounds plus the normal jingle. So that's pretty much it for this thing on its own. Let's go ahead, we'll bring in the gamer driver and get to the extra sounds that we get here. Alright, so plugging it into the gamer driver. So standard level 1 sound, but you get the really nice red LED there. So transforming to level 2. Not bad, not the best jingle in my opinion, but all right. Pop into level three. I definitely like the level 3 jingle better than the level 2. A lot of fun there. 
that's pretty much it for the sounds with the gamer driver. So let's go ahead and bring in the Kimawaza slot holder. Pop it in. Nothing too thrilling there, normal critical strike sound we're used to. Mm, popping it in the Gashicon breaker. I like that a lot, that's pretty cool. And the key slasher. So kind of interesting there that it says Tatsujin, whereas the other things have said Taiko no. So that's kind of cool. So in all honesty, I would say it's a decent set, but is it something you absolutely need to pick up? Probably not. It really depends on if you're trying to collect all the Gashats. I mean, if you're Gashat crazy and you're trying to collect them all, then obviously you're going to need to pick up this set. Uh, if you have a way to watch the DVD, obviously that would add value to the set. Um, even if you can't understand everything, I feel like you could still watch the episode and enjoy it enough that, you know, you could figure out what's going on just kind of intuitively from watching it. Uh, and all the real, the forums debuted are really neat and it's really cool for that reason. Um, you know, but if you just figure, oh, I'll download that somewhere and I can watch it with subtitles and I don't really care about the gas chat, then you could easily pass on this. I don't remember it being ridiculously expensive. I think the set was maybe like 25 to 28 dollars if I'm remembering correctly before shipping, of course. Um, so it's really not bad in that re in that respect. I mean, gas hats are usually somewhere in the area of 12 to 15 before shipping, depending on where you pick them up. And, you know, then you're kind of paying $10 for a DVD. Again, if you have a way to watch it, very much worth it. If you're just going to have it, I mean, the box art's nice. You know, you can download the episode, so then it's kind of like you watched it. <laughs> but like I said, your mileage is really going to vary on this one because... If you don't have a way to watch the DVD, it's not the most exciting gash at, so I could see how you'd pass on it, but it's really going to be up to you in the end. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below, if you think it's worth it or not, if you're not that excited about the gash at. I mean, if it was some kind of Legend Rider or something exclusive to this set, I feel like it would be more of a draw, but it's still a perfectly cool gash at. I don't have any problem with it. I like the sounds it makes. The picture's nice. The LED's nice and bright. Nice bright red. So, again... I think it's perfectly good, but it's not, like, flat-out amazing. But let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Please like and share this video, and please subscribe if you haven't already. I hope you've enjoyed this look at the, and I'm going to butcher the name again, DX Taiko no Takujin Gashat and Kamen Rider Genmu DVD set. And as always, guys, thank you so much for watching.